Alright everyone, welcome back for some more Mass Effect 2. So, I just want to apologize to anyone who's going through these. I actually might have realized it before, but like my second Mass Effect video, for whatever reason the sound is all fucked up. It's like, well it's way too fucking late to go back and fix it, so I'd recommend just skipping that video. Like what kind of YouTuber is like, hey, skip that video. Not like I'm making money off of it, but still, even if one day I'm making money off of this, just go, do yourself a favor and just skip that video. I don't know, I don't fucking care. There will be other Mass Effect playthroughs. I didn't name this shit Angar Vanguard Angard. Vanguard asshole for nothing. Cause we're we're going to have others. So there will be more. But in time, I'm working a lot now. It fucking sucks. Commander, you might want to speak with Tally. She seems very worried about something. Yeah, we'll talk to her eventually. But we're going to get a little shit done. Hit the wrong button. Wrong button. Yeah, we're gonna get some shit done, and then what I really want to do is I'm feeling some Dragon Ball Z Battle of Z because I haven't played that in fucking what three, four fucking years probably. It's been forever. Like, pretty sure that came out before the first Xenoverse, and we should play the first Xenoverse too. I just saw the disc. Shit, I'm not sure where it is now, but. We should do that. We're gonna mop up some shit. I got time. But yeah, I would like to record some of that tonight and upload a video or two of that. Could do both of the Xenoverses. Eventually it will. I actually made a couple videos of the first or er, the second Xenoverse, but the sound was all fucked up. It was it was terrible. I'm about to go back and do some adjusting there. Oh yeah. <laughs> That'd be fun. I'm pretty sure I've beaten every stage in like the figure battles too. Yeah, I'm like positive. I'm 99% sure I did. Cause I remember like wanting to do it for long. Oh shit. Sure, whatever. I remember wanting to do it for a long time, and I think I finally fucking did it. And it was mostly luck. It wasn't even the last few guys that got me. It was. Uh, it was someone else. I can't remember who, but. They're just a pain in the ass to finish. Don't waste your time on me. You're already the voice inside my head. No, no, no. You gotta put on the gut plasma shotgun. Yeah, you guys. We got the we got the fucking hookup now. It's fucking sweet. I forgot how much I hate this place. See the landing pad? Has to be on the roof. Or the vegetation would overgrow it in a few hours. Shepard, I am picking up thermal signatures everywhere, except at your landing zone. Something's distorting the sensors. This was a secret Cerberus facility. Yeah, they build their equipment to last, assholes. It was a mistake coming back here, Shepard. When nope. we start a mission, we finish it. Yeah, okay. Let's get on the ground. One of my cats has ki had kittens today. Five of them. Or outside cats. They're all outside now, but I had two more that are about to pop. Oh boy. And a lot of kittens. Until s something happens to them, then we'll have a couple kittens. It's just nature. It's how it is. Not how I want it to be, but how it's kind of got to be, because there's a lot of fucking cats otherwise. A whole lot! Let's just. Oh, we got this fucking. Get in there and plant the bomb and Strong ass inferno, that's nice. And what, Jack? And what? I'm not sure if I've ever used this gun, so that's the only reason I wanted to use it. Cause yeah, the mod Madoc, or whatever the fuck it's called, that is my rifle. Oh room. boy, oh boy, do I like that rifle? It's fucking great. Stuff and starving, but alive. Usually, this is unbelievable. I don't mean to bring Smar for this, like. Uh, it's whatever. I just always bring her, I feel like. Either her or Miranda. I don't think I've ever brought anyone else. Next playthrough, we'll bring someone else. Kind of thinking, uh... What's that black dude's name? I can't remember. I can't remember, because I never fucking use him. Jacob. I never use Jacob. I feel like most of us never use Jacob. He won't find out. The elusive man. 
Sounds as if this facility turned rogue. He didn't say what they were hiding from the elusive man. Did I cut her off by trying to open the door? I remember escaping to this room, fighting here. I saw sunlight through the cracks in the ceiling. Only a half-dead guard between me and freedom. He was begging for his life. Trying to remember how to play. It's been a... Okay, it's only been like a couple days since the last time, but I didn't really do shit. We've been spotted. This is not the best. I'm also not hitting enough, but... Ah, get away. Don't waste your like time on me. You're already That's right. the voice inside they used to my stage head. Here. Pit me against other kids. I loved it. Only time I was ever out of my cell. What were they studying? Hell if I know. Maybe that's how they got their kicks. I never understood anything that happened here. How often did they do huh. this? I was in a cell my whole life. Sometimes they took me out and made me fight. Filled me with drugs, other stuff. Time gets funny in a cell. Did the other children die in these fights? I know, I did some I hard time kid, once. Filled with drugs. I got a whole less than 24 hours. It might have been 24 hours. It been 24 hours. Attacked. They actually rewarded Could have been like 24 to get warm 28 hours, no more than that. What the Pissed hell was off. wrong with those people? I don't know. Doesn't matter now. Let's keep moving. Hell yeah. Okay, does this shepherd? Yeah, it does have a shotgun. Sweet. Let's put this on for now. Let's put on that sweet, sweet inferno ammo. We're probably gonna get shredder ammo. Max that shit out. That'd be awesome. We just need some element in zero to redo our shit. But I'm all for it. Security officer Zimkel, Telton facility. The subjects are out of their cells. They're tearing the place up. Subject Zero is going to get loose. I need permission to terminate. I repeat, permission to terminate. All subjects besides Zero are expendable. Keep Jack alive. Understood. I'll begin the. That's begin the what? Right. I broke out when my guards disappeared. I started that riot. It looks like there was a lot you didn't know. The other kids attacked me. The guards attacked me. The automated systems attacked me. That doesn't leave lots of room for interpretation. That was the first time I said that to her. So you got to experience it first with me. This oh man, a little nicer than empty. that. Who the fuck shot that I have a hard time being a full <laughs> asshole in games, like most people. Who are an asshole. We just know how to feel too much. We're over here listening to... Uh, What's that one? I can't think of her name now. Susan Boyle. That, that's what I was thinking of. Bro, we're over here listening to Susan Boyle. Everyone else is listening to some thrash ass shit. Ah. Get it! I, I just want you to blow up, man. I just want you to blow up. I, who's charging? Ah, oh, man. Don't waste your time on me, you're already dead. And the voice inside my head. I'll destroy you. Can we go over there? Yes, we can. Oh, wait, no, we can't. Can't target them. Can somewhere, I'm sure. Can't reach the no? You can't. Okay, different room, different room. Alright, better get in cover. Can't target them. But I want to. I'm missing my visor with that extra headshot damage. Shit was nice. Why'd they need a morgue? This was a small facility. I fear the other children died in great numbers. Even then, they were a part of the experiment. Bullshit. I had the worst of it, and I made it out alive. Oh, come on. You didn't give it to me, or what? Oh, it's right there. Okay, come on. You didn't give it to me, or what? <laughs> Next one. There we go, and yeah. Give it to me, good, 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 good. Give it to me. What, what? In the butt. Well, I said what, what? In the butt. Well, I said what, what? But you won't do it in my butt. In my butt. You won't do it in my butt. In my butt. You won't do it in my butt. In my butt. Let's do it in the butt. Okay. Matter if you have a little fight or something like that. Don't you worry. I won't bite. Not that hard. If you okay, want it, I'll give you power. Shit. Just be gentle. Well, I'm delicate like a flower. Give it to me. 
Good, 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 good. Give it to me. Good, 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 good. What, what? In the butt. Well, I said what, what? In the butt. Well, I said what, what? In the butt. I need to watch that video. First the South Park one, then the real one. Goodbye. I'm trying to go Cujo on me. You ain't doing it. You ain't doing it tonight. You ain't doing it tonight. You ain't doing it all right. Hey man, let's say I had a pissed pot in. Wait. <laughs> My bad. Pot to piss in. And bunk beds. I always wanted bunk beds when I was a kid. I didn't get them until I was a late teenager. You go away. Oh, I can't look right at you. Nope. It's like those floaties in your eyes. You can't ever, you can't ever really look at it. Goddamn little floaties. And they always ignored me. I just remember going to like the public pools and then, like, holding, taking a deep breath, being <laughs> put yourself face know. down and just try to float this as long as you can place. and hope people think you're dead. <laughs> I do that shit all the time. No one ever bought it. It's fucking bullshit. <laughs> okay, I thought they talked about something over here. No. Okay. Huh. Yeah, we're gonna abuse in this bad boy. I like it a lot. Entry 1054, Telton facility. The latest iteration of Pergnum went poorly. Subjects 1, 4, and 6 died. No biotic change among the survivors. Damn dog, that's crazy. We lowered though. core temperatures of surviving subjects, but no biotically beneficial reactions occurred. As a side effect, all subjects died. So we'll not try that on zero. I hope our supply of biotic potential subjects holds up. We are going through them fast. This is bullshit. They weren't experimenting on the other children for my safety. This whole place was built to turn you into what you are. You don't get it, Shepard. I survived this place because I was tougher than the rest. That's who I am. You move on, harder and tougher. Yeah, that's one way to be about it. What am I looking for? No! Right there. This should come in handy. Biotic damage, oh yeah! It's all fallen to pieces. The subjects are rampaging and Zero is loose. We're shutting Kelton down. What a disaster. We'll infiltrate and piggyback onto the Alliance's ascension program. Hopefully, that will give... Who oh, what? Zero, wait! Shepard, they started up somewhere else. Ascension is an alliance program. It's a school for biotic kids. They don't torture children there. A lot of this isn't the way I remember it. You couldn't have known. Maybe. We're getting close to my cell, the place I came from. Let's keep going. Hell yeah, we're a boss. Let's do it. Hey, Arash, it's Turek. Yeah, the intruders are here. You want them dead? We have to talk creds. Ugh. You promised us lots of salvage, but this place is a waste. Fine, we'll put them down. But I'm coming in there and we're gonna talk salvage. You're in my way. Get them! We've been spotted. Oh, yeah. Slap high, 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 and the world turn it whoa inside out and whoa. Why'd you gotta move my screen like that though. Float it around in ecstasy, cause don't stop me now. Look at them floating up there. Don't stop me, cause I'm having a good time. I'm having a good time. I'm a satellite. What happened to my blast? You bitch. You bitch, what'd you do with it? That, that gun is so goddamn cheap. I love it. Where is he? You're not dead like the rest of them. You should have been. Should have did yourself a favor and been dead. Coming to get you. So we're, we're done, right? We're done? We're done? Yeah. Alright. Moving on. What is over here? Wait, what? 
Okay. Come out. We know you're I thought here. there was a door behind those guys. But it was gonna take me some Who booty. My name is Arash, and you're breaking into my home. I know you, Subject Zero. So many years have passed, and I thought I was the only survivor. My name is Jack. How the hell do you know me? We all knew your face, Jack. They inflicted horrors on us so their experiments wouldn't kill you. You were the question, and I'm still looking for the answer. Why did you come back? I hired these mercs and came back almost a solar year ago. We're rebuilding it piece by piece. I'm gonna find out what they knew, how to unlock true biotic potential in humans. I'm restarting the Telton facility. It will be beautiful. Dude, it's I fucked wanted a up. hole in the ground. He's trying to justify what happened by using it? This place was like a prison. How did you get out? We all attacked at once as they were taking us to the lab. They would have put us down. But then Jack got loose. When I came to, it was over. The guards, the scientists, and the kids were all dead. And you were gone. I stopped it. All of it. Maybe the others did have it bad, but what you're doing is just messed. Everything we went through must have been worth something. We can blow up the place, but that still leaves him. What do we do with another you? That's easy. Just leave me here. This is where I belong. Fuck that. You're here to erase your past. He's part of that. I... Shit. Is this right? Will killing him fix my head? You're a killer, Jack. That's what you do. Well, now, so. Yeah. That felt good. A bullet in the head solves everything. I know that now. This room was my whole childhood. Give me a minute to look around. Go ahead. Nothing's changed, but it's all different. Okay. Normally, what happens is, uh,. You like look at some shit in there and she'll explain it. And then she says that and it cuts. I, I don't know if maybe that's because we uh, killed that dude or what, but. That's probably a bigger explosion than I needed. Oh well. Hey, we gained a level, ain't that? Fan, fucking fantastic. Do you have time to read that by now? Because we're moving on. Yay, warp ammo. Heavy damage against health armor and biotic barriers. So it's just all around better. There's better ammo. Sounds good to me. So I think right away when we get back, we're just going to end this video. I'm trying to have less fuck ups where it's like oh now I'm uploading a minute long fucking video I'm trying to nip that right in the butt but it's hard out there it's hard you know what I'm just gonna end it right here I'm gonna end this right here and we're gonna be right on back as soon as we get back to the sh oh wait nope cause, yeah, okay we gotta, we gotta stick this out a little longer you and me you and me and if there's more people watching this you 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 hopefully there's a lot more use at some point and me it's all of us. We're together again. Or for the first time. Whatever, though. Oh, boy, I gotta be... Well, I gotta leave for work in, like, 11 hours, but I'll be awake for a while. Hot minute. I'll deal with it. Take pictures. Touch me, and I will smear the walls with you, bitch! Uh -oh. Enough! Stand down, both of you. The cheerleader won't admit what Cerberus did to me was wrong. It wasn't Cerberus. Not really. But clearly you were a mistake. Screw you! You've got no idea what they put me through. Maybe it's time I showed you. My opinion is the one that matters. You two keep a deck apart at all times. She can't be trusted, Shepard. She'll jeopardize the whole mission. If we survive this, you two can tear each other apart. Until then, save your hate for the Collectors. She'll survive. 
I'll make sure of it. Then, I'll tear you apart myself. You two gonna be okay? It's a good thing you came by when you did. Yeah, I could tell. As long as she does her job, we'll be fine. Thanks, Shepard. Alright. Weird flex all around, but how's it going? Commander, what can I do for you? Do you have a minute, Miranda? Of course. We're gonna talk I'm to just everyone. finishing an operation report. I'm impressed, Shepard. So far, things have gone exceptionally well. As Cerberus operations go, this is one of the best I've been a part of. Maybe that's because this isn't a Cerberus operation. Not to you, maybe. But I report directly to the elusive man. And I'm here because he wants me to be. Cerberus gave you a second chance, Commander. Maybe you should do the same for us. What did Cerberus do that made you so loyal? Hmm. I suppose you deserve to know. Do you remember when I told you how I was genetically altered? Well, that wasn't my choice. My father created me. He's a very influential man and extremely controlling. He didn't want a daughter. He wanted a dynasty. I ran away as soon as I was old and brave enough. I went to Cerberus because I knew they could protect me. You seem capable of defending yourself. Why did you need Cerberus? My father invested a great deal in his dynasty. It wasn't a matter of just leaving. I knew he would continue to pursue his investments. I assume that Cerberus approves of your enhanced abilities? Of course. Cerberus fully endorses anything that advances the cause of humanity. Genetic alterations included. But unlike my father and his own selfish reasons, Cerberus and the elusive man believe in a greater good. They see the bigger picture. And I feel like I have a purpose here. Who exactly is your father? A businessman. But a very wealthy one. It's ironic. My father believed deeply in a human positive agenda. He donated generously to Cerberus before I joined them. That's how I first heard about Cerberus, through my father's connections. Whoops. You've told me a lot about your father. What happened to your mother? I never had one. Most of my genetic material is based on my father's tissue. His Y chromosome was altered with an amalgam of desired traits from various sources. How arrogant can you be? The man is completely egomaniacal. Just another reason I had to get away from him. You talk about yourself like you're just a tool to be used. By your father? By Cerberus? Maybe. Dude, I like, like to know about where I me, fit in the world. It helps me find meaning in how I was created. You are who you are, Miranda. You don't need to make excuses for it. That's easy for you to say. We've both been engineered for greatness, Shepard. The difference is you were great before we rebuilt you. I'm great because of it. Your spirit and personality are what make you great. It's what makes anyone great. That's kind of you. I'm not sure I believe you, but thanks for saying it. Thanks for your time, Miranda. I'll talk to you later. Anytime, Commander. Catch you on the flip side. If you, if you, if you know what I'm saying. I, I, I don't. I actually don't. I actually don't know what you're saying. Do you need something? Have a few minutes to talk? Certainly. If you don't mind my saying, you don't really seem like an assassin. You've spent too much time fighting thugs who think custom-painted armor makes them professionals. The Hanra trained my body for this role since I was six years old. You've been killing since you were six? Of course not. I didn't make my first kill until I was twelve. They were training. Of course me. not. I was seven when I, I murdered my first person. Thrown away. I was an investment. You were a child, not an investment. I've given you the wrong idea. They valued me, yes, as a resource, but also as a person. They regretted their need for me. The Hanar, excessively polite, worship the Protheans. They don't seem the type who train assassins. Every species trains assassins. The Hanar are only unusual in that they need other species to do the killing for them. I they have adjust. strong grip and natural toxins, but have you ever seen one move quickly outside of water or fire a gun? Why did your parents agree to this? You just said they they turned the Wi Fi off so I could it's kind of happening. It was an honor for our family. The compact. We live on the Hanar homeworld because they rescued us. 
some of us, from extinction. We owe them our lives. That is the compact. What exactly are the terms of the compact? There are many things the Hanar can't do, even with mechanical aid. They ask Drell to assist them. This can't be legal. They made your whole race into slaves. Don't insult me, Shepard. Anyone can refuse to serve. Few do. We owe our existence to the Hanar. We are proud to repay the debt. The way you describe it, the Hanar sound like weaklings. Out here, they are. But if you could see them in the encompassing, the oceans of Kaje, you would see them differently. A stream of silver in the dark, looping, diving. So fast the eye can't follow. Laughter like the squeals of a child vibrates the water. They fly over the black of the seabed like birds, gloomed with the light of heaven. Okay. Why was your race going extinct? Overpopulation. That must sound trite to you. Humans developed mass effect drive before the problem became acute. Our homeworld, Rakana, had few resources. We hadn't even developed fusion power when the soil <coughs> began to fail from overuse and pollution. The Hanar found us a century ago. They sent hundreds of ships, evacuated thousands of us. Billions more had to be left behind. What's the state of Rakana now? Do you read your philosophers? A man named Thomas Hobbes? Oh. When all the world is overcharged with inhabitants, then the last remedy of all is war, which provideth for every man by victory or death. As Rakana died around them, my people slaughtered each other for mouthfuls of water, crumbs of food. But you don't kill for the Hanar anymore. You're freelance. What changed? I was asleep for a long time, yes. I paid no attention to what my body was asked to do, but then... Laser dot trembles on the skull. One finger twitch. He dies. Then, the smell of spice on the spring wind. Sunset-colored eyes defiant in the scope. The laser dances away. My apologies. Drell slip into memory so easily. Was that one of your assassinations? Uh, yes. Perhaps we can discuss it later. I've wasted too much of your time. Okay. Kinda have to. I'm on a I'm on a schedule right now. Talk to Samara. Morinth haunted my dreams and waking hours equally. For the first time in four hundred years I am free. I am a ruined vessel of sorrow and regret, but I am free. It is not a feeling I can describe. Was it worth it? It was never a question of worth, but of need. I had to take the action I did, as did she. This was never a story that would have a happy outcome. You did your duty. What about your feelings? One of my daughters is dead. My hopes, my dreams were all bound up in my children. Still, my feelings have always come after my duty. The same is true of you. You said that Morinth was a monster, but she was still your daughter. She was the strongest and smartest. She would not accept the injustice thrust upon her. She fought to the end. I am so proud of her, Shepard. You killed her for being what she was. And I would again. But I also know what it means to leave everything behind and fight. Do you realize that she went on the run at the age of 40? I do not know human years well, but it is very young for Asari. What will you do now that Morinth is gone? Assuming I survive your mission, I am a Justicar. Injustice still exists, and perhaps even other Aratyakshi. There's no way to correct the condition Morinth had? We are an advanced species, but we don't have magic. When the trait manifests at maturity, it is too late for mitigation. It only occurs in purebloods like myself. Perhaps that is the root of the stigma regarding Asari-exclusive pairings. I don't know. I thought Ardat Yakshi were extremely rare. Asari have spread to many worlds. There are remote regions with no government oversight. If I travel to those worlds and they do exist, I will find them. Morinth claimed that her condition was the future of the Asari race. Morinth would say anything that served her cause. Ardat Yakshi are sterile, Shepard. That wouldn't be a particularly viable future for my people. Morinth claimed that her condition was... Morinth Ardat Yakshi are sterile, Shepard. You don't want to settle down? I did. 
I returned to my homeworld and tried to start a family. I will fight and struggle all my life. That is my fate. When I die, it will not be in bed. I am at peace with that. You still control the direction of your life. I have chosen this path. I truly am at peace. Due in no small part to you. All right. So I think we'll go do Garrus' mission in a fucking minute. All right, I'm going to end the video right here. Then once it gets back, I will start it back up. And yeah, we'll go do Garrus' mission. Goodbye.